Welcome viewers to our deep dive into the world of ultrasonography. In this ultrasound case study, we delve into the intriguing findings of coelolithiasis affecting the right submandibular gland. Pay attention to the clinical signs. They're vital for suspecting this condition frequently missed by ultrasonographers. Patient, 35 years old, presents with recurrent right submandibular pain and swelling, intensifying during meals. Symptoms have progressively worsened over several weeks, prompting this ultrasound evaluation to investigate the cause. The initial scenes of the recorded examination showcase the gland slightly enlarged with a marginally heterogeneous echo texture when compared to its contralateral counterpart. This subtle disparity sets the stage for further investigation. As we progress to the second scene, a mild intraglandular ductal ectasia becomes apparent within the same gland. This finding suggests an obstruction within the ductal system, prompting a closer examination. The subsequent scenes bring to light a calculus located in the mid-portion of the duct, marking a significant discovery in the diagnosis of coelolithiasis. The exploration continues, revealing another calculus positioned more distally within the duct in the distal third beyond the initial calculus. This secondary finding underscores the complexity of the case, indicating multiple obstructions within the ductal pathway. An innovative maneuver was employed where the patient was instructed to press the floor of the mouth downward with the tongue. This action led to a captivating moment captured on ultrasound. The distally located calculus was observed to migrate towards the mid portion of the duct, nearing the first detected calculus. This dynamic movement not only illustrates the mobility of the calculi within the duct, but also highlights the potential for patient induced maneuvers to aid in the diagnostic process. Coelolithiasis, characterized by the formation of salivary stones, can lead to pain, swelling, and even infection if not promptly identified and managed. This case, with its multiple calculi and ductal ectasia, highlights the potential for significant obstruction, underscoring the critical role of ultrasound in early detection and intervention. For more insightful cases like this and a deep dive into the fascinating world of ultrasound diagnostics, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications.